Hey, good morning, Periscope and Replay viewers, Facebook viewers, YouTube viewers, everyone. My name is Israel Wendy, and we're going to praise, uh, do some gospel praise today. And we're here to worship Jesus and do some painting. So I hope you're ready to praise. Yes, get the fire going today. Because don't you know, it tells you in the word to, that you are to stir yourself up. You're supposed to daily stir yourself up. So let's get stirring ourselves up with some gospel praise here. Yes, God bless you and welcome to the broadcast. I hope that you uh, uh, share it out and uh, that um, you invite your followers and thank you ahead of time for the hearts. So, yes, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Here we go. Let's turn things around here. We're going to paint some trees today. Some happy little trees. Woohoo! All right. <laughs> okay. Let's find some worship music here. Yes. Let's get some worship. Of AK. Okay. I had it already, but the minute I clicked on it, it went crazy and took off. You know how that is. Things don't always work out. So here we go. This is Karen Clark with uh, Show Me Your Glory. So show me your glory. And we'll get painting here. I thought that I would try to use my knife today, but, you know, I'm going to be painting trees, and trees aren't perfectly straight. So we're going to paint some trees, and they're not going to be perfectly straight. Whoa, what a voice. Hallelujah. We're just using plain old brown to do the trees. Just plain brown. And this is acrylic paint. And I'm using paint number one, so it's just cheap paint. Thanks for joining the broadcast. I'm getting out my titanium white and uh, lamp black in case I need it. I hope I don't use up all the brown because I just had to put some on order. Wow, what a voice. Woohoo, I love this. I'm gonna welcome to the broadcast. I'm gonna tip it down. And yes, I'm using a paper plate for my paint. I don't know why, but this brown is very thick. Welcome, Jacqueline. We're doing some gospel music today. Today is Gospel Tuesday. 
and I'm on every most mornings about 8 30 to 9 30 if you'd like to join me oh boy my paintbrush is uh, shedding its hair all right we're gonna draw some trees in here and yes they're gonna appear that they're floating in air but we're putting a hedge too so there's gonna be a hedge in front of the trees. So we're gonna start out with a tree coming up this way. And a spindly little tree. And I did not water my paint down enough here. Yes, Lord, give us your favor. And the tree goes straight up, but then it has some branches that kind of go over this way like this. Oh, that cut off short. That cut off short, didn't it? Wow. Welcome, welcome to the broadcast. That cut off short there. I'm having a hard time with this pain. It's so thick. There is more yucky, yucky. Maybe I need to put the the glaze in it. A little thick or Couple branches coming if out this way too. What I, really need. Yeah, I just this is terrible paint. I'm glad I ordered some more. I'm gonna just get a different brush too. Now will you Well, that's a little better. You can see my paintbrush. I got a wedge one. Direct the paint a little bit better. Thank you for joining the broadcast. If I told you what I really need. All right. 
Like I said, it's going to look like they're floating in midair until I get the hedge. I'm going to put a hedge in front of it because I'm painting my backyard here. right off out of the page here. Say yes to Jesus. Thank you for the hearts. I haven't sent out your package yet, Jacqueline, because I have not been to uh, the post office. Now there's a little bit bigger tree next to it here. And it is very close. Coming up like this. And it's kind of leaning over by the mm -hmm. tree. These trees are intertwined here. And that one continues up too. And this has a little branch coming off this way that kind of goes up this way like that. And don't worry, we're going to make these look more realistic. They look like a graveyard trees right now they look scary like out of a scary movie but we're gonna give them some life just like Jesus gives us life yes hallelujah and this this one here this gets littler and littler and it has you know twigs coming every which way here out of it but they're tiny little ones so we'll get the uh, more detailed uh, brush for some of the smaller twigs here yeah the father gives life yeah hallelujah praise God Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. He is our life. We can't do anything without Jesus.
There are things behind here. There is more that I require of me. There is more, so much more. Jesus. So much more. Praise God, yes. He says, seek my face. He says, seek my face. It's all kinds of uh, trees going on here behind here because it's a woods. Even between these trees, you got stuff that are, you know, going on. Yes, Lord. I might have to give up and there are people in our lives we just but my soul says yes. are caustic to us. You mean everything to me, Jesus. You're the first and foremost. We love them, but we can't be around them. Well, you guys are doing a good job preaching there. Hallelujah. While I'm painting. <laughs>
The Bible is not corrupt. That's the lie of the enemy. Because they have, uh, they found the Dead Sea Scrolls. They've, um, and they found that the Bible has not been corrupted over the ages. It's been. Yeah, that you're taking uh, the words out of context. That was for a certain situation. That's not for every situation. out of context because it was for a certain situation for one situation it was uh, God wanted uh, Moses to do something um, they wanted to go into a land um, and possess the land and God was telling them what they needed to do that was not for every day. What you are doing is you're trying to um, disprove or, or in your mind, you're trying to um, say bad things about the Bible. So you're just coming up with uh, single Bible verses that, you know... Sit took the Quran and you took one verse out of the Quran yes he said that but it was for one situation the Quran tells everyone to to, to kill uh, people that don't believe in the Quran So does that mean the Quran is corrupt? Which it is, yes, I believe it is. I'm sorry, I don't go into your, uh... I'm sorry, but I don't go into your scope to disrupt it. You are out for no good. And this scope is a relaxing scope 
people come here. It's a refuge. People come to hear the music. They don't come here to ar hear the arguments. So I refuse to allow that to go on. I'm going to block you. I may unblock you when uh, the broadcast is over with, but if you're going to disrupt the, the scope, I'm going to block you. I'm sorry. I'll pray for you. I love your brother, but... People look for Christian scopes just so they can disrupt and they can cause problems and they can argue. And I'm not going to argue. Welcome to the broadcast. Hey, Latoria, how are you, sweetie? I need your address because I want to send you a little gift for uh, being a super fan. I haven't sent them out yet, though, because I haven't been uh, to the post office. Turn it this way so you can see what I'm doing here. Yeah, I'm painting out my back window here. And I know the trees kind of look like they're floating, but um, there's going to be a big hedge in the way there. I was kind of worried that somebody might buy the forest because I got forest on two sides of me uh, in, the, in the front and in the back and I'm like I hope nobody buys the, those woods and cuts it down and makes a house 
but I uh, found out it's uh, owned by the utility company, so I don't think it's ever going to get sold off. some more paint here. I had already had two people on here that wanted to argue doctrine and I just yeah your secret place Yes. Yes, love is who you are, Lord. I wanna be where you are. Yes, that holy place. how they all kind of lean that way and they don't lean the other way but maybe that's the way the wind blows Awesome. 
감사합니다. Our God is an awesome God. This is Jay Thomas. Yes, he delivered me from my fear. Hallelujah. Welcome, Rick. How are you this morning? Papa Rick. can't see the trees for the forest. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
I'm just painting out my back window here. And yeah, the trees look like they're floating in midair, but there's going to be a hedge there. Because I have a Forsythia hedge. Praise God. Yes, he hears our cry. Praise God. Thank you for the hearts. Pretty yellow friendship hearts. I hate to say what color this looks like to me. <laughs> yes, hallelujah. Boy, Rick, you would be able to sing this song. Wow. Probably better than uh, Jay Thomas. Thank you for joining the broadcast and thank you for the hearts. <laughs> hey, Kat is here. Hey, congratulations on being um, a VIP. That is awesome. I wonder what the record uh, for the fastest uh, becoming a VIP, because, wow, that is incredible. Of course, you have incredible scopes. If you guys aren't following Cat Ello, you should be. Gosh, she has awesome scopes. All of you guys do. Rick, his uh, scopes are at night. Make sure you follow him. Latoria, she has awesome scopes. Everyone. The Jesus Did It group is such a good group of uh, broadcasters. And if you don't know how to find them, just hashtag Jesus did it. I tell you, Kat, you got VIP so quickly. I'm like, wow, that is awesome. That is awesome. It won't be long before David gets his uh, VIP. Joshua's already got his. 
Whoops, there's a clump of paint right there. It kind of looks like a knot in the tree. This isn't the greatest paint here. <laughs> this is like beginner level paint and beginner level paint brushes. Wow, what a voice she has. That is Karen Clark, in case you're wondering. Wow, wow, wow. Yes, it is. Yes. That's a cute testimony. Family is so important. Oh, Jacqueline, you don't have to be embarrassed. The Holy Spirit will lead you. Just, uh... 
I haven't um, painted anything hard. I've only painted like landscaping, like trees and stuff. But I'll tell you what, I can't draw a straight line. I'm too shaky. But you can't tell because trees aren't supposed to be straight anyway. And if you uh, scope your painting, I'll be watching you, Jack. <laughs> Definitely. You have the support of the Jesus Did It family, that's for sure. They are such a loving, supporting family. Oop, I got too much paint on my paintbrush there. I'm going to end it with this song, and you guys probably know what's coming up. Because <laughs> I love this song. Yes! Hallelujah! That's right. Every praise is to our God. Every word of worship with one accord. I don't get tired of this song. <laughs> Sing hallelujah to our God. Every praise, every praise is to our Spiritual warfare. I like the beach too, especially in the winter time. <laughs> I like to think about being on the beach when it's cold, you know.
He is everything to me. Yes, he is. Yes, shout it hallelujah. Every praise to our God. Yes, praise him today. Praise him. Show him that you are a Christian. Show him that you are the ambassador of Christ. Show that love. Show that love. Show that love for for your fellow man. We are loved. Yes, dance for him. Everything you do, do for him. Praise God. Because of the work on the cross, we are free. We are free to praise him. We are full of joy. Hallelujah. Praise God. Praise God. Should I? So thank you for joining me today. Um, make sure that you're praising God even when you don't feel like it. <laughs> Especially when you don't feel like it. When you're uh, going through stuff, yeah, praise God. It'll make it'll make it a lot better, believe me. Believe me. When you can uh praise God in your storm, things will seem a lot easier. 
So God loves you. Um, make sure today that, that you bless somebody by showing God's love to them. It do, you don't have to preach at them. You can just give them a, a simple act of kindness so that they know that, that Jesus loves them. Because Jesus loves us all. He loves us all. So God bless you. This is Israel Wendy over and out. Thank you for the hearts. Thank you for joining the broadcast. And God bless you. And make sure you catch uh, Rick uh, Costa on uh, his scopes. He does awesome um Scopes at night where he reads the word and he um, answers questions and he sings a really good song every night. And he sings these songs uh, not along with uh, other artists, but he actually performs these songs himself. So this is it's an awesome uh, time of worship. So God bless you today and over and out. This is Israel Wendy.